See the smile behind my mask. How long will it last? Stimulus going fast. Government won't act. How long will this be going on? I'm standing here in line. Aloha. This is Scott, your soulful progressive with FNN. Feminist News Network at Feminist News. That's right for you. Welcome to Sky and the Abba Pue Room, giving you that soulful news you need. Yes, indeed. If you haven't told a friend to like and subscribe and get that soulful news, that soulful way, well, sweetie, let them know they can get it today. I know that's right. So what is it I want to talk to you about today? What is going on? The U.S. Census. The 2020 Census went through exactly as Trump wanted it to. Doing what? Cutting the numbers of black, brown, Hispanic, and Native American people while upping the numbers of white Americans and Asian Americans. This is ugly. Now we're going to take a listen to BNC on what's really going down and then we're going to discuss. So let's take a look. Mm-hmm. 18 million people in America were told they don't quite count. Millions of black, Hispanic, and indigenous people were miscounted in the 2020 census. Now you can blame the pandemic and extreme weather events, but the greatest challenge was the Trump administration. Tasked with overseeing the once in a decade assessment of who makes up America, the Trump administration undermined the effort at every turn trying to force some questions about citizenship, to deter undocumented people from participating, to simply ending the census count early. A few percentage points across several minority groups, resulting in the largest miscount in decades. This skew count of who makes up America will literally cost black and brown communities their fair share of tax dollars and fair representation in Congress. Uh, small towns to big cities to states to counties to school districts all kinds of decisions millions of decisions each day and this is not an exaggeration rely on those census numbers where should the bus stop how many bus services should there be how many peas should we deliver to that school district how much road should we pave which road should get paved first and when black communities are undercounted and that's what we're showing here the census itself is saying that they undercounted black Americans by three times as much as they undercounted us during the Obama administration. When that happens, we get fewer bus stops, less well-paved roads, we get fewer peas in school, and it can affect how many votes the President of the United States gets. So what do we have to do? Uh, and I, I really appreciate the lawsuits that we're bringing right now to fix these numbers as best we can, but we also ugly, have to ugly, take advantage ugly. of the next 10 years to replace the census with better technology, technology that actually counts all Americans. Uh, because what we're doing now is leaving us woefully. Mm, mm, mm. I know you saw that. And it was ugly as hell, those numbers and those statistics. Talking about 3% for blacks, 5% for Native Americans, and 4% for Hispanics. This is what's happening, people. I talked about it when I talked about the 2020 census. Check out my videos. You got a link you can click below and see all 600, and I got at least two of them about the census, if not three or four. And what I said before is the same that goes now. They want these people that are getting their numbers higher which are your Asian, we're talking about Indian Americans uh, from India, and Asian Americans in prison. They want them to take on white privilege and bring themselves up. And just like the white Cubans, Venezuelans, and other Hispanics, they want them to take on that white privilege too. That way they can have more that is against the poor and the black and the brown. And it's wrong. Throughout history, the Irish took it on and then became white.
The Italians came and then became white. The Jewish came and then became, and now they're doing it with Asia. And if you can't see what is obvious, something's wrong with you. And we need to change this because we saw it when he hired a guy to add the immigrant uh, uh, question to change the whole thing. And they weren't trying to hire. They weren't trying to send people out like they should. If you didn't show up, so what? And states are losing benefits, federal funding, and every damn thing else, and going side by side with the suppression bills and voter suppression bills and other ethnic against ethnic people suppression bills and against women suppression bills like the abortion ban. We see America turning in the wrong damn direction. We cannot go back two, three hundred years and try to rise the South again within our government. It's bad enough they're fawning over Ukraine and helping those people while ignoring the deaths in Yemen, Syria, and Libya, and all the rest that's going on in Somalia, Bucatan, Morocco, and everywhere else. And they're still trying to cause coups and bombing people. Now, this is ugly. And you're not hearing it enough on mainstream news because they don't want to talk about it. That's why I showed you from Black News Channel. <sighs> ugly ugly and there's a reason for it and we know what it is so it's time for those general strikes it's time to let them know they're not right it's time to show it in your vote and who runs and who is going to change this thing because we got to wake more people up to what's really going on and if you agree with me leave those comments below and let me know at feministnewsing at gmail.com. Don't forget to like and subscribe to that YouTube channel and Facebook page. I got that Patreon too. Yeah. You know what to do. And remember, during this era of hate, you're going to have to participate. Because if you don't, if you don't, we're not going to have And if you don't, it's going to be worse than 1984. This is real life. Fascism, authoritarianism, oligarchy is real. Corporate capture of government is real. The war industry is real. So you know what to do. Get involved in your community. Boo. Mm -hmm. And if you care to donate, give me a cup of coffee, you can at Venmo at SkySocialProgressive.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining. Peace. Think about it. Organize. Do something.